Watch this. Isn't that interesting? In this video, I'm going to show you how to animate segments of a pie chart to replace existing data during your presentation. Welcome to another episode of Amazing Sticky Presentations inspired by Sticky Spy, bringing you tips, ideas, and design for better presentation, turning your ideas into lasting impressions. Hi, Tian Tech here with Sticky Spy. In my previous video, I showed you how to design an interesting pie chart using the app tool in PowerPoint. So now, we are going to take that pie chart from the previous video and add animation to it. If you are a Keynote user, I will have another video soon showing you how to do this same animation on Keynote. Before we can animate the pie chart, we need to make some preparation to the pie chart so that we can assign animation to it. This will make your presentation super slick, bringing it to the next level of stickiness. Okay, let's begin. Let's make a duplicate of the slide that we have created in our last video. First, we need to ungroup the pie chart as we have previously grouped all the segments together. And we want to regroup each pie segment with their respective tags. So let's do that quickly. Next, we need to add an oval to all the pie segments and objects that we want to animate. This will be the Korean, Chinese, and the car icon. Let's do that right now. We shall start with the Korean pie segment. Select the oval from shapes, then hold on to the control and shift key on your keyboard and draw from the center of the pie chart. Then go to the format pane to adjust the transparency of the oval so that we can see through a little. Adjust the oval shape so that it sits nicely on the pie segment. Once you are satisfied, go to the shape option to click on no shape and no line so that you get a transparent oval. While the oval is still selected, hold on to the shift key on your keyboard and click on the Korean pie segment to add to the selection and group them together. Next, do the same for the Chinese pie segment and the car icon. We need a new pie segment for Malaysian made car. Let's duplicate the Korean segment to make a new Malaysian pie segment. Align the duplicated segment to sit exactly at the same position as the original. Then change the color of the duplicated segment to blue and expand the arc of the duplicated segment to approximately 17%. Change the text to 17% Malaysian. Once that's done, rotate it so that it is positioned on top of the Japanese pie segment. Okay, all is good. Let's now reorder the groups. Click on any object on the slide and go to Shape Format, then Arrange, then Reorder Objects. PowerPoint brings you to a 3D view of your slide and you can clearly see the object layers. Let's arrange them in the order of other, Chinese, Japanese, Korean, Malaysian, car and title. Okay, we are ready to animate. First, we will animate the car, spinning it clockwise, followed by the Korean pie segment. We do that by using the emphasis effect. 
click on the animation tab then bring out the animation pane next click on the car icon then emphasis effects and select spin we are going to spin the car about 27 degrees clockwise at a duration of one second let's test it out by clicking on the green play arrow next we animate the Korean pie segment using the same technique spin 60 degree clockwise we want this to start with the car so we assign in timing start with previous because the previous animation was the animation of the car duration of 1.1 second with a delay of 0.1 second A delay here because we wanted the car to spin first before the Korean Pie segment follows slightly later. Once the Korean Pie segment is hidden, we want to get the Malaysian Pie segment to spin out from behind the Japanese Pie segment. The techniques are the same, it's just assigning different parameters to the animation. For this, we will spin 67 degree anti clockwise start after previous at duration of one second as the malaysian pie segment is spinning out of its hiding we want the car to follow so we assign spin of 27 degree anti-clockwise to start with previous at duration of one second finally we need to spin the Chinese pie segment slightly to make room for the larger Malaysian pie segment that is 17% 2% larger than the Korean let's do this now spinning 13% anti-clockwise to start with previous at a duration of 0.45 seconds delay of 0.65 seconds We want to shift the Chinese pie segment just at the moment when the Malaysian pie segment is about to hit the Chinese pie segment. And we do that by assigning a 0.6 second delay to delay the start of the animation. We need to make some adjustment to the amount of spin for the car. Notice that the car stops too early. I want it to stop just before the Chinese pie segment so we will need to change the spin to maybe 40 degree that should do it let's try perfect now we need to order them into the proper layers so we go to the reorder objects let's bring the Japanese pie segment forward so that it's on top of the Korean and the Malaysian pie segments if you run the animation now you will see that everything falls into place so isn't this fantastic yes it's going to take some planning and you will need to invest more time to create something exciting like this I always say it is worth it because things like this differentiates you from the other presenters and makes you stand out from the crowd I hope you had fun watching this video don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this question for you how do you create your pie chart and what style of animation do you use to animate your pie chart leave me a comment below 
I would love to hear how you use animations for your pie chart. Until my next video, have fun with animation. Bye bye. Until my next video, have fun with animation. Bye bye.